Hello YouTube, I'm just going to make a quick video on, I know Sony's coming out with their one terabyte PS4 and I, just for a simple amount, for me personally I have Amazon Prime, so on Amazon I got the upgraded hard drive, um, two terabyte that will fit inside your PS4 for $130 free shipping. I believe you can probably get this drive, it says one night, it says 129 um, without Prime, probably f uh, five or seven dollars for shipping. Um, and then also, if you don't have that amount of money, you can get a one terabyte for even less than that. You can get about a one terabyte for about between fifty and um, sixty dollars nowadays, lowest. And uh, this is supposed to only be a really quick video, so I'm just going to run you through my PS4 real quick, see all the stuff that I have on it. Um, as you can see. Let me just go over to settings real quick. Sorry, it's really hard to do. It's really hard to use one hand here. Um, so if I go to System Storage Manager, you can see that my PlayStation 4 has 1.77 terabytes of space. Um, due to the the format of the drive, always takes up a good portion of the drive. The more, the bigger your hard drive, the more format it takes up. I mean, the more space it takes when you format it so you can see for applications I have 734.8 gigabytes installed um, game captures 954 uh, kilobytes 154 megabytes of same game data and 100.62 megabytes of uh, themes and I still ha seem to have 1. 1.03 terabytes free um, it's just good if you don't want to have to uninstall, reinstall a lot of crap. Um, it helps out a very lot. Um, just one thing before I go. If you're going to do this, make sure you just uh, back up all your saved game data um, to the cloud if you have PlayStation Plus. If not, copy it to a flash drive. Um, if you have any questions about this, please leave uh, comments in the comment section, obviously. Questions in the comment section. This is not the best video, I just want to put this out here. It's, it's extremely quick, it took me about, I want to say to download the, because you need to download the installation file, all that crap, put the drive in, um, and all that stuff. I'm just, um, if you are still under warranty or anything, make sure you don't throw away your 500 terabyte hard, I mean 500 gigabyte hard drive. Um, you need that for your warranty and stuff if you have to send it back in. Um, like I said, any questions on where to get the file or whatever, just leave it in the comments, and I will do my best to leave it in the, um, and back in the comments, shout back at you guys. Alright, peace.